there you go. <laughs> Better than 830. Well, hey, turning now to Broncos country. So they've released their official schedule for the next season. Early this season, Colorado, they're going to have a matchup that is personal, Katie. Yeah, here's a look at the Broncos. They are going to have their first regular season game September 8th against the Seattle Seahawks. The second game against the Steelers and former Broncos quarterback Russell Wilson. That is one that a lot of folks are going to be watching. I got my tickets Including last night. Tony. I jumped oh, did on. You? I got our push alert. And I reminded me tickets are on sale, so I bought tickets. They I figured were, you sent that push They were <laughs> not cheap, but uh, I also want to point out that a month later in week seven, Denver's playing the Saints. That head, that's head coach Sean Payton's former team, and it's the first time he's going to face them while coaching the Broncos. I want to point out that they're going to play the Chiefs <laughs> twice, which is exciting. They, I know they normally do, but the home game isn't until, what, week 11? Oh, it's a I already uh, called the tickets for my husband. I was like, I'm going to that game. <laughs> good move, good move. <laughs> All right, now to the Rockies. The Rockies just keep on winning, and yeah. we are we're here for it. I I'm surprised. I did not think I'd be saying this, but the Rockies, they now have the league's longest active winning streak. That's why I'm wearing my Rockies purple today. Um, it's seven in a row. You seven said it's in a not row. A fluke. No, I don't feel like it's a fluke. I think they figured some something.